Hey guys, what is up? It's your girl Nia from Charming Lashes and I am basically doing another vlog. I'm gonna go to Publix. Publix is literally right next to us. I'm gonna go to Publix, get some groceries to make this smoothie, have a little breakfast, or brunch or whatever and then set up for my appointment so okay guys so i am back home from publix and i bought the stuff that i need i got my ginger got my lemon and my he's cutting up the um cucumbers right now but that is not for the drink i have two well i have three cucumbers one of these are gonna go in the drink and then he's slicing those up so i can have with some tuna so where's my phone so basically it says that I am going to need one cup of pineapple. I have my pineapple right here already chopped from Publix because I was not about to peel and chop up a pineapple. Mm -mm. Then I got me my cucumber, a chalk of ginger, 16 ounces of water, and a half a lemon. So we're going to do a half a cucumber. Oh, so then just slice those up fat, like put them in chunks, like they can. 16 ounces. Does this have ounces on here? What? It doesn't. It only has milliliters. Oh, wait. Ounces is right here. It could ask you a cover if you can never have. Okay. Cool. Sprout the whole thing, is it? You know, like fatta? Yeah. Why? I'm going to blend you up. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, my. What is this? Is this. A, oh, yeah. This is a Nutri Bullet. So, it has my ounces here. So, I'm going to go ahead and. Put 16 ounces of water. Get that done from now. Boom, 16 ounces. Then a cup of pineapple. Where's our measuring cups? Oh, there they are. Perfect. Got my measuring cups. Did it say it said a cup of pineapple, right? Yeah one cup of pineapple oh I also bought this from Publix because it actually tastes good so and it's chlorophyll I say chlorophyll is good for you to intake so let me try one mmm it's real good you want to try one? Juicy. It's my cup. Put that in. And then half a cucumber. He already sliced up the cucumber. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in right now. No, but I'm going to slice the whole thing. Yeah, put the whole thing. No, that's for my tuna. Oh. So I have my slice of cucumber. And then one chunk of ginger. Does the ginger go in with the skin? So apparently I have to have a one large cup in the morning and one large cup before I go to bed. So it's 12 o'clock. I didn't eat anything besides that one pineapple you guys just saw me put in my mouth. And yeah, so I'm starting a little late, but I had to get the ingredients and all that stuff. So yeah, it's 12.10 right now. I'm trying to get this done before my client because I have to go set up. I didn't set up. So yeah, I'm gonna just start drinking this drink right here. It's only 35 calories and it is nine grams of carbs, but it actually tastes good. If you guys are wondering what this tastes like, it literally tastes like lemon water. And sure, the grams are sugar. No, there's no sugar. Well, there's it's seven grams of sugar. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it literally tastes like lemonade, but without like a light lemonade without the sugar. So, yeah. So I got my ginger, that in, and then. Might as well just put the last piece in there. Extra burner. And then, yeah, we're going to go ahead and blend this up because that was the last of it, right? Let me see if I got... Oh, my lemon. See, I almost forgot that. A half a lemon. Throw my half a lemon. My battery's going to die. Are you kidding me? Okay. Let's do this quickly before it dies. Hopefully, it don't cut off. And let's blend it. I don't want it to die, you guys. So, let's turn it on. See, it's on, and we're gonna put it on high. Oh, there we go. This is the concoction. 
It don't smell bad, it just smells like ginger. My camera's about to die, so I'm trying to do this quick so you guys can get my reaction. Let's see how this I smell is. more to that cucumber. I smell ginger. Let's see. I'm afraid that I smell cucumber. It don't taste bad. I can do this. Period. Mm hmm. Don't taste bad at all. It has a little spice, but it's not like super spicy. So I'm gonna be slurping on this before my appointment and then I'm gonna drink my other half before bed. So I got me a little bowl, put my little cucumbers in it like this. And then I'm gonna put my tuna packet on it. So this is how it looks. Yummy. So I got this tuna because I've had it before back in the days when I used to go to the gym. I used to be eating these because they were good and it's only 80 calories and 17 grams of protein. And they have different flavors, but me personally, I like the lemon pepper one. He don't like lemon pepper, but I like the lemon pepper. So what I'm gonna do is just put the cucumbers in a bowl and have this on top. And that's basically my breakfast with this drink. So yeah and then for lunch after work i don't know what it is but after i finish lashing i am so so hungry so i'm gonna eat my salad that i got from publix it's a chicken caesar salad so that's what i'm gonna eat and then yeah just drink water i'm gonna try to fill up my gallon of water thing and then just chug that down for the day and that's basically it Boy, i've been watching you It is currently 5.44. I didn't time myself to see what time I was leaving, but I'm back and my nails are done. So, this is what they look like. I'm not too fond of this hand. I feel like he did it a little too thick and was like getting the little shaky hands. Um, so yeah, it's low-key bothering me. I might go back tomorrow and tell them to fix it. But I'm one of those people, I don't know. Like, I don't want to because I don't want to be one of those people. But then it's like, your girl spent $150 for my feet and my hands. So, mm, I'll figure it out tomorrow. I'm editing. I just decided to put in this quick little update. I did end up changing my nails, you guys. I just did not like them. I couldn't stand it. So, they were nice about it. The next day I went and they let me change it and everything like that and um that's basically it in the next clip you're basically gonna see me just jump straight into my trip because i didn't record myself um packing or anything like that because it was super super busy in my home so yeah hey guys what is up it's your girl nia from charming lashes and i am finally on my trip i am in fort lauderdale right now but we're going to miami as you guys can see miami is literally right down there y'all see that i hope i'm not blocking the mic but yeah you guys so i got my battery all charged i got my sim card i got my tripod and we're about to go to miami and have some tacos because i'm so excited there's this place called coyo taco and i'm like me and my husband we love that place so that's where we're gonna go i have on this cute little green top but that's why if you guys can't see it and you're wondering but yeah let's go on this trip because i have been side eyeing me right now he's like let's go i'm waiting so yeah you guys i'll see you guys at the place something at mcdonald's real quick hello um good morning can i have um two cups of water please and a, a small fry a two two large cups of water Yo, he getting french fries. He knows I love fries, but I'm trying to control myself. I know I'm about to eat a little crazy with my tacos. And I love fries as much as me do. What? Are you crazy? We couldn't, we literally couldn't come and not get fries. Do you know how many? No, that's called self-control. Also, you have more self-control than me. Right now, yes. The lighting. I'm good. When I go back, it's like a shadow. But um, 
Yeah, he got french fries. You know I'm about to eat some of his fries too. Yeah. yeah. My nails. So cute. Okay, fine. No, that's fine. She said no pennies. <laughs> No pennies, meaning no change for you. I love this bag, this sweetie meal bag. It's so cute. And I have yet to try her meal. Whoop up! They filled up those fries because they knew I would want some. Definitely. Look at that. Filled up his fries because they knew I wanted some. But yeah. What? Look how long these are. Mm. Wow. Mm -hmm. I think it's got to keep the prices. Why, why is that lemonade? Mm -hmm. I love fries. Hey guys, so we are back in the room and basically I'm so upset because it was like raining super super like heavy and bad so I could even take my camera out because it was raining and I didn't want to get my camera wet. But pretty much all I did was go to Koyo Taco. I had the tacos that I've been waiting for for so, so long. And that's basically it. And it's so funny how now that I'm back in the room, it's literally like clear skies, no rain. Literally, look. So, literally like nothing happened. But if you guys never had Koyo Taco, I highly suggest you get it because I'm obsessed with tacos and that by far is best taco I've ever had hands down, so go get you some foil taco um so now we're gonna go out and um go to this action place where it's like a jumping place and they have all these activities so we're gonna go do that now and yeah i'm most likely gonna bring you guys with me so you guys can at least see that and yeah i'm so mad because i had this cute green top on and i don't know what happened but this little stain here like it's my second time wearing this and since the first time it got messed up and now the second time it got messed up but whatever anyways i'm gonna go ahead and change into some comfy clothes and we're gonna go head out again so see you guys in the next clip what is up um so today is my last day here um basically what time is it it's about 10 o'clock i believe 9 50 10 ish um so yeah i don't really have much planned today i know the only thing that i have planned is to get me and my mother some cajun boil um there's this place 
called Cajun Boil. It's in Brickell in Miami, but I just searched it up and I see that they have another area in Plantation. I'm not too sure about that. I don't want to like, you know when you find your spot and you don't want to try another spot because they might like downgrade your food or just jack it up. So I'm kind of hesitant. Whereas if I should go there, because it's 20 minutes away where um, the Cajun boil in Brickell is 40. So, hmm, I'm not sure. I think I might just do the Brickell one. Don't mind my hair, you guys. I have to like push it back in order for it to stop falling on my face. But um, yeah, that's basically it. Yesterday, it was a horrible day. I was so, so mad because I literally got dressed, put on my favorite top and everything like that. And as soon as I recorded the area where we were going to yesterday, once we got in the car and picked up my husband's friend, by the time we got to the area, it literally started raining. Like We didn't even get to park at um, Coyo Taco because it was just raining so, so bad. So we had to keep driving around, driving around. And I was so hungry. And when I get hungry, I get like really, really cranky. So I was so over it. Didn't get to record because I didn't want to take my camera out since it was raining. So that's okay today is a nice sunny day the day i'm leaving but i don't know hopefully i can get some cute like footage and content for you guys but i'm not sure fingers crossed but i'm honestly not sure what i'm gonna do but um as you guys can see it is nice and sunny again and this is how it was yesterday and literally you guys it just turned to black like really black so so yeah, you guys, that's basically it. I am almost done packing. I didn't really bring too much stuff. I just have a little stuff to put in my suitcase now. And that's basically it. My battery is at the second bar. So hopefully that's enough footage for me, like enough battery for me to um, take uh, vid videos and stuff. I might just put it on the charger because checkout is at 11 and it's 10. So probably give it like one hour to get a nice juice charge, so. Oh, this is the outfit for the day and don't mind this bag or my suitcase I'm still packing but yeah you guys that's basically it I wanted to show you guys a couple clips of the hotel um, but there wasn't really much to see uh, this hotel don't get me wrong it was nice and clean a nice hotel I stayed at the Marriott in Fort Lauderdale North um, but Pretty much that was it. The pool's closed, the gym's closed, so there's not really much to do. We just basically sleep here. Um, but when you walk in, this is a door and then there's like a little vanity area. Um, there's the shower, but he's taking a shower so I can't show you guys. And here's the mirror. Don't mind the mess, you guys. We're packing still. Here's me. And then there's like a cute little couch here that you can lounge. I'm not sure if it's a pullout bed or it is a bed i'm not sure um we had mcdonald's last night i have to throw that out and our bed it's a little tv what i like about this tv is the remote you don't have to touch it when you turn it on it gives you an option to use your phone as your remote i didn't do it but my husband did so i'll catch you guys in the next clip <laughs> just got home not too long ago i like changed my outfit and everything makeup looks old i am tired we just had like a four hour drive three and a half but you know tired but i did want to show you guys this before i start editing this video um i just warmed up my coil taco yes i saved a taco because i love their taco so so much and there's no coil taco where i'm at look and this is the pollo alambre and then I got this sauce with it. I don't know what the sauce is qual called, so if I were you, just ask for it, every single sauce. Just figured I would show you guys that before I eat it because I didn't get to really vlog 
me going into Koyo Taco, me ordering just because it was raining that day and I didn't want to wet my camera or anything. So, yeah. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this messy vlog. Um, and yeah, I will try better next time. Hopefully, something else is interesting this month or this week, and I'll record that vlog as well. But yeah, until then, go ahead and like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn on your post notifications if you haven't already. And yeah, you guys, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.